Hey yo everyone, welcome back to another modded Terraria video. Today we are checking out the Hyper Mode mod. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pop something up on the screen so you guys can read this together with me. But the Hyper Mode mod makes all NPC AI twice as fast, enemies move faster, shoot faster, and who knows what else? The Hyper Mode mod also makes the player move and act twice as fast, attack speed double, respawn twice as fast, who knows what else. Makes all projectiles AI twice as fast, yours and your enemies. Spawn rates are doubled, time moves twice as fast. But yeah, this is a mod I wanted to check out for a while, but for some reason my old Terraria was corrupt as hell, who knows why, it's because I kind of jerry-rigged a T Model Loader 64 installation, I kind of just started dragging and dropping stuff when there was already stuff in there. But who cares, as we can see, things are moving a bit faster. That's slime is bouncing awfully quick the guide he's running at a brisk pace even my character is running at a brisk pace look at this this is some speed but yeah this is a very cool mod and you know possible wheel of terraria challenge but uh we're gonna test out a bunch of things primarily with movement and uh you know we're just gonna see what happens when we're moving twice as fast pretty much and uh as you can see it's already midday it was like what a third a third of the day in that's usually when i start recording so i'm trying to build a minecart track here so we can test out uh my car speed but as you see when i start building what do you guys expect oh my god all right so we got one of the fastest mine carts in vanilla terraria and then i'll probably test out the one from thorium because i think that one goes a little bit faster but let's go ahead let's see just how fast we can go here we go let's see let's see i mean i guess the speed might be the same but in terms of how fast we actually travel in game i don't know do we usually do you usually hit 102 miles per hour on this uh mechanical mine cart? i have no idea but this is this is like 100 blocks and it's killing it in no time all right we got the rocket mount here from thorium i don't know if this is faster like like I said, let's just test it out. Let's test it out. All right, it doesn't really, oh, no, nah, it does feel faster. It does feel faster. I'm kind of tempted to just, to just jump and see what happens. <laughs> I gotta time the jump perfectly. Dang, oh my god, we were going so fast the game froze. All right, we're gonna test out a couple of mounts here. I'll probably, I mean, no, nah, I'll definitely miss some that you guys want me to test, but oh well, it happens. So we're gonna test out the bunny mount first and see how fast this goes. Hopefully this platform's long enough. It's pretty long, not bad. The bunny looks very weird looking when it's moving, but that's not too bad at all. Let's go ahead, let's test out the next one, which is from uh, Thorium. It is the, uh, what is this thing called? Infernal Hound. This thing uh, is pretty fast. Yeah, look at this. Oh my god, okay, we have 76 it's not bad it's not bad can we end up at the end of the track oh shit we fall all right next we're gonna do the unicorn which is a very very fast mount okay not as fast as the pound apparently i thought this was a lot faster but mods are always better all right next up we're gonna do the uh, shrimpy truffle we're gonna dip it in water and see how fast we go and i'm assuming very fast 67 nothing is being that uh infernal hound yet but i think this last one might do the trick we got our last one here from the calamity mod the fabsol mount or whatever the hell it's called it's a, it's a my little pony unicorn let's do it let's do it here it goes i expect us to be zooming oh shoot we hit the hundreds no problem that that's pretty fast it's definitely the fastest we've seen oh not to mention that we can fly oh my god look how fast we go when we start flying what was that we hit like a plus 100 oh my god 124 so i had to test one more mount before we stop looking at mounts you ready this mount is pretty insane i, I just wanted to see how fast this one can go Okay, we're making some progress. All right, we're gonna test a little something here. I got this item that I can't scroll past because as you can see, uh, the hyper mode mod makes your scrolling messed up a little bit too. Come on, bro, just scroll to number six. It's not that hard. All right, I got some here though called the Wall Breaker 3000. We're just gonna put it to the test, all right, and see how fast we can break these walls in hyper mode on top of this being an extremely fast wall breaking hammer. So let's do it. Let's see how it sounds because we know it's gonna sound beautiful. So this mod makes projectiles shoot twice as fast, something like that. So, you know, why not get one of the fastest projectile shooting items that I know? I think the P90 is pretty fast. And, uh, you know, let's put it to the test with hyper mode activated. It's actually, it's pretty smooth. I feel like we can get faster because I know there is some faster guns, but this was a nice control that we can test first. So uh, let's, let's amp it up. All right, we're going to test out the Soma Prime now. Let's see what this baby sounds like. Oh, oh, 
Ooh, I don't like that one. We're gonna try out the Hellabut cannon now and see what this sounds like. Is that how you even say that? Hellabut? Hellabut? I don't know. Halibut. Okay, this is actually not too bad. I think it really depends on the audio of the gun, you know, because some guns, they got really annoying audio. This is not too bad. I think the worst thing about it is if you shoot the floor, you get that weird ass noise. Now, I got a question here. What happens if we start getting a little destructive? No, 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 we're getting destructive too early. We got more things to test. All right, we're gonna test out this barred weapon here. I'm just kidding, it's from Calamity. But yeah, we're gonna test this out here and uh, we're gonna see, you know, what it sounds like. It makes music. Oh, that's that's the right click. Oh, look at that, you get a little, little jukebox. Okay, oh, and I get to aim where, okay, I like that. But let's go ahead, let's test out the left click. Oh. Yeah, I don't like this one either. This sounds like when you're playing like a Pokemon ROM hack and then you speed it up, you know, go times two speed. And then let's also test out track this true Paladinian Mage Hammer of Might. Honestly, this feels the same, but it is faster. It's pretty much two times fast, but it feels the same. But yeah, I'm obviously going to miss a bunch of weapons that people are going to want me to test out. Go ahead, try it on your own. You know, I did drop a tutorial so you can learn how to install mods. But if you're on mobile, 3DS, console, oh, well, it's too bad. So let's test out the Alpha Ray now. Oh, yeah, that's a beautiful noise. Oh, I need to turn down my headphones. We're going to test out the Onyx Ea. It's actually not too bad. I've heard worse, definitely, in this video alone. Now the Azathoth. I'm kind of entertained by this. I can probably do this for like 10 minutes straight. All right, so the next really big thing that I want to test out is bosses and how they move. I want to just see, you know, get a little example of how fast bosses be bouncing around, flying around and all that. So let's go ahead and start with the King Slime. And uh, I don't expect the King Slime to move too fast. It's not really that fast of a boss, but I don't know. This is, this is looking like if you're playing on like death mode or something, this is like the King Slime's like normal speed. So not too bad. Go ahead and see the Grand Thunderbird, which honestly another boss that I don't expect to move too fast. Oh, kind of jittering a little bit. What the heck? Does it always look like that when it dashes? I mean, it looks faster. I mean, everything's going to look faster, but it still flies around. It still does the same attacks. Well, obviously it does the same attacks. It doesn't get new attacks. All right, we have made it nighttime and we got the Eye of Cthulhu here. And I kind of want to see the Eye of Cthulhu second form. I want to see that in action on hyper mode. All right, so we got it here in the second form. We probably got to get a little bit lower. So it actually starts dashing. All right, here we go. Near death looking like nonstop. Oh my God. How do you even fight this? This thing is moving. Is it going to take a breath, a breather, something? Nonstop movement. You think it would get tired? Oh, he's definitely losing calories. Checking out the destroyer i don't think the destroyer is gonna move that fast at, le at least so far it's not moving too fast at all looking like normal speeds what oh i didn't mean to kill it trying to think of some more bosses that are kind of fast i mean this one was at decent speed but it's always moving jittery like this there's not really too many bosses that go that fast besides one other one and i don't know how it's gonna react because this world is not in post moon lord so uh let's see how it acts we're gonna summon in the devourer of gods what's up everyone this clip is being recorded at 6 a.m in the morning while i'm editing the video and i wanted to test the wall of flesh real quick so we're gonna summon it in. We're gonna attack it a couple times just to get it low enough to where I could, uh, you know, actually see it move fast. And so far, just looking directly at it, eye test, it's not going too well. Looks like he's moving normal speed. I mean, obviously once we get him lower, he's gonna move fast. I don't know, I feel like so far, a, a majority of this mod is a placebo. I, I'm, I don't know, I'm, I'm not feeling it. All right, let's see what happens here. I'm not expecting good things at all. Okay, it's not bad. So we're in a mount that makes a uh, dog move really fast, as you can see, the move very fast let me open up the map and see if that helps at all so we can keep track of the head but yeah on this mount for some reason dog moves very fast because he like moves to your speed or something like that and as you can see he starts going flying so what happens if we take the omega core okay so now we got the omega core let's see what happens with dog when we start moving around with this oh my god we're flying at the speed of light we're making things oh my god and he flew past us we're going back to this side and see what happens oh my god look at the mini map he's on my ass go 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 i keep on going into all these caves and stuff i'm running out of flight oh my god what a chase scene we're moving so fast my game might crash all right to end off this little showcase we're gonna use the hellebuck cannon here and we're gonna fire a bunch of rubber mortar rounds and just see what happens uh destruction obviously but we'll see how fast the destruction is and how destructive it actually is but uh let's go ahead okay i have the wrong thing equipped that's why try again oh yeah we losing frames we losing frames 
They're bouncing back up, you know, as I expected them to do, because they are bouncy mortars. And uh, we're at 10 frames now. I don't remember it being this uh, laggy last time I did this. And I've done this a good bit of times. Uh, I've done it with dual wielding. I think I've just done it straight up without the dual wielding mod on. This, this is an experience. I don't think it'll crash my game, because it does take a good bit to crash Terraria. That's a lie. I can look at the game the wrong way and it'll just crash on me. But, uh, you know, it's kind of satisfying. I like the noise this makes. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to check out the Hyper Mode mod. It's a very cool mod. Check it out on the mod browser. I'm very happy that I'm able to play it. Thanks to reinstalling my whole entire Terraria, because it didn't work on my old Terraria. And uh, I will see y'all in the next video. The NPC Olympics are going to be like Friday or Saturday, all right? Ooh, get ready for that. Also, make sure to check out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash GamerDurs101. And also make sure to check out my second YouTube channel, VOD Raiders 101 where I post my full Twitch live streams.